Welcome back, I'm playing They Are Billions, and last time we did the Coast of Bones, and we're going to move on. Um, I think I'm actually going to try the 20,000, and see how that goes with my units. And I also have paper I never read, so no future planet on the brink of collapse. Mankind is facing an unprecedented crisis that threaten, is threatening the survival of our species. The most recent population figure shows our planet is more is home to more than 90 billion people. Governments have claimed that their hands are tied. They've run out of solutions to provide their citizens with access to most of life's basic necessities. Food scarcity and energy shortages are growing and alarming reality for most citizens. What's more is that these issues are profoundly compounding our dwindling health care and education systems, the same systems that in recent years have become accessible only to the wealthiest among us, while some leaders are putting radical measures into place trying to gain control of the situation. Most scholars fear that any solution will be too little too late. Well, things went turned bad pretty quickly there, it looks like. Oh man, 20,000. But they're all weak and slow. I feel like we should be able to do it. into groups. Commander? This way actually looks kind of weak, right. so let's bring more over that way. At your service. Bottom looks a little weak. Up top. I guess we should keep some guys Order, at the base okay. in case things get uh, overwhelmed. Just me to the let's put you up here. On your orders. Put you guys there. Sorry, sir. I was cleaning my weapon. Tell me. All right. Yeah, I'll try to put them in groups. Of course, my commander. All right. Commander. Order, sir. Ready and wait. Guys are doing a shit job up here. And you guys didn't even kill anybody. Let's go. Waiting on orders. At your service. Our forces are in danger. Commander? Understood. Tell me. You At your service. Let's go. Order, sir. All the way. 
tell me what to do. Our forces are in danger. Order, sir. are in trouble. Tell them. Come on. back that way. like 30 minutes of just shooting I think.
people here that these guys are coming up. This hole, then I guess. Back. Seems like groups of four are a pretty reasonable amount. Doesn't look like anybody else is running past me at this point in time. Nope, that's not true. It looks like there's a little stream here. That's so minor. Commander? Order, sir. Just tell me what to do. Fifteen five. So their rate attack damage goes up dramatically. Their attack speed goes up. Range goes up. Order, sir. Ready and wait. Commander? Oh, the humans! 
like I got everything plugged now. Not seeing anything getting unplugged here. So I feel like I've got enough guys here to protect in case there was. So given how slow this is going, the question is, is do I feel safe enough to go try to do something while this is uh, playing right now? Oh.
Oh my gosh, this thing is still going. All right. You know, I kind of like, you know, mixing it up with the different maps and everything here and the different objectives. I think that could be interesting. But the way it is right now, I mean, it feels like a lot of these missions just like astronomical numbers. And they view that as being just the numbers themselves are challenging, but there's no reason this couldn't have been 10,000 or 15,000. I mean, these are totally un upgraded soldiers. They're just doing their thing. Positioned on the map here, blocking up the main pathways. And now it's going to be, what, 30, 40 minutes probably by the time I beat this mission. It just feels very monotonous. monotonous. I don't know. If you guys feel otherwise, let me know. But uh, that's kind of my impression on some of this. You could have had the same experience with, you know, five, ten thousand less units. You know, you know they're slow moving, so it's not like, oh, ten thousand is so much more, or twenty thousand is so much more challenging than ten thousand. Unless something dramatically changes, but at this rate, with how this slow they move, it's like it's the same tactic and the same thing is done. Now it just feels like it's getting drawn out. Or now it's getting to be a little bit frustrating. Versus, uh, you know, the other missions where it's, you know, the swarm was actually, you know, 2,000. You were sitting there pushing them back, fighting, having to retreat. This is, you know, once you get to the, where you find out where the paths are, you just fight back to that way where they start spawning and they just position a couple guys there. I think that's kind of my main critique with the uh, hero missions too is, you know, there's they're not bad and I'm not opposed to them having it. In fact, I think it's probably a good idea for them to switch it up so people don't get bored with doing the same thing over and over again, but they confuse, I think in this game, lots of units with being the same thing as being challenging because you know that's what the apocalypse setting is is 800 plus percent increase of um, zombies and you know on the building missions that certainly is more challenging but for things like this that doesn't feel to be the case or with the hero missions it just means you know go getting some of the running the fresh uh, zombies run around in circles, shoot them, run around in circles. So it just drags out the mission a lot longer than it has to be, especially um, since there is no saving in the middle of a mission. If you lose, you lose. So. What have we been doing, like 20, 25 minutes so far, or something like that on this? The swarms are done over here now. So don't see things flashing. Let's go. 
Hopefully if I move you forward a little bit more, kill him right at the spawn point and expedite this a little bit. Sir, Commander, any orders? Commander, at your service. Man, I've literally got him on the side of the map, and I'm just waiting for him to spawn in to get some kills. Three hundred more. Waiting on orders.
last hundred. Given how long that mission took, I think I'm going to call quits here for the day. I hope you're enjoying these videos. If you are, please give my channel a like and subscribe. Encourage me to post more content for you. Have a great day.